All right, welcome back everybody. We are on to a case of uprising. So we're gonna do uh, a couple uh, couple box opening videos here, opening one box in each video. Hope uh, hope you're enjoying most of the videos that uh, that I've had uh, already. Pulling some uh, some pretty pretty good stuff for you on camera. Still uh, still trying to see if I can actually pull a fabled on camera. Seems that uh, seems that I can crack those uh, without any problems off camera, <laughs> but when it comes to opening something special on camera, it literally just not in the cards. So hoping uh, hoping we get some good content for you. Hoping to see a uh, fabled somewhere here as I turn those into uh, PSA fours. As I shuffle those out, uh, all right. Um, First majestic of the box here. Um, <clears throat> Uprising has been a really awesome set. Um, I mean, we are post Dynasty release already at this point, but I'm still uh, still loving opening the product, still loving the uh, the cards, and love a lot of what uh, what they added in here. Um, that uh, that just helps out uh, helps out decks and uh, is really. Uh, Really brought some new, uh, new and interesting heroes to the game. So, uh, second foil rare. Sorry, it's taken me. I've been opening a lot of Dynasty lately, so it takes me a couple, a uh, couple packs here to remember order and what's where. Not, uh, not used to seeing some of these uh, generic, uh, generic action cards. So. And then just trying to remember which, uh, <laughs> what order and what's where in the packs. So, uh, your first couple are usually, uh, usually a couple generics, some sort of, uh, some sort of action cards as well that pair with the, the heroes of the set. Then, uh, you have your two, uh, either a rare, two rares, a majestic and a rare, um, and then, uh, then comes the foil, and then you've got uh, the rest of your commons in the back. Potential for finding a uh, cold foil in the back. Um, I think the regular cold foils, I believe, all come or can come in the uh, the front, and then a lot of the marvels that uh, that are out there will be in the back. Could be wrong there. I don't uh, don't quite remember. Like I said, I've been opening a lot of. A lot of Dynasty lately, so I don't remember exactly where they place all of the uh, all of the cold foils in these packs. But these uh, the the set definitely uh, feel like it was a little more generous. All right, nice uh, invoke Dr Dracona Optimi. It's uh, one of the better uh, better majestic uh, one of the good majestics that you can open in the dragons. There, or I guess one of the better dragons to open. Um, but uh, yeah, still uh, still trying to remember where uh, where you find everything. All right, majestic number four, the frightmare there, common. This, uh, this damn sigil of protection always always gets me. Looks too similar to the uh, the blood of Drakai, so I always end up thinking that, uh, that that's the fabled, and then I get disappointed when it's not. But. Happens usually at least once a box, so we'll uh, just roll with it, and hopefully I don't make the mistake of calling out a fable and getting excited, only to realize that it's not. But it happens. So uh, two more rares, foil common, and where are we at? Still looking for that cold foil. Like I said, uh, uprising. I feel like uh, I feel like they were a little more generous than uh, than, than Dynasty. Um, at least it felt like uh, you were opened a cold foil almost uh, almost in every box, or at least in every box. Um, sometimes two. I've actually seen upwards of three cold foils get opened in a box. Um, heck, I've seen a uh, seen two legendaries opened in one pack. So there's always uh, always the chance for that. But um, yeah, or. <clears throat> Feel like uh, feel like the, you saw a little more of the uh, 
of the cold foils in uh, in these boxes than you did in, or than you do in Dynasty, and maybe it's just uh, maybe it's just how everything got distributed, um, sorted, collated, whatever uh, whatever you call it. But um, yeah, these definitely felt like they were a little more powered up compared to uh, compared to Dynasty. But I enjoy enjoyed opening both so far. So. Had some uh, had some pretty decent luck with uh, with all of it, so not uh, not complaining about it. Um, of course, as I say that, we're coming towards the uh, we're we're down to the last uh, I'm about the last third of the box and still haven't seen it cold. Well, and there it is. All right, it's that uh, you start talking about not seeing it and it shows up. So just a common, but uh, still pretty uh, still a pretty card. I love the uh, I love the foiling that they've got on here for all of these cold foils. It's definitely something that attracted me to the game and uh, got me interested in opening first edition stuff. For as uh, as things are now with uh, starting with Uprising, and they got rid of first edition and have the chance to pull uh, foil legendaries, foiled fabled, um, like rainbow foil legendaries, rainbow foil fabled. So. Um, and then rainbow foils of all of the other cards that potentially could be cold foil. So kind of neat that, or I kind of like how they went with that model. Gets uh, gets out of the rut of having uh, having first edition and uh, having first edition and then doing unlimited. So all right, last couple packs of the box. Uh, speaking of first edition, keep talking about it in a lot of my other videos, but. Got uh, I got two cases of Crucible First Edition. Uh, like I said, I'll be cracking at least one of those. So get that on camera for you all of you and for you to to, uh, to see what uh, what it was like when the game first started and uh, what that uh, what that supplemental set has for us. But I'll open up the one if uh, if it's really good. I will probably oh there we go. Look at that. Boom. That was even. Normally they have this side forward, but awesome. See, like I said, have the chance. A bit of, no, I think I was just dust on the top. No, eh, yeah. But hit ourselves a uh, cold foil marvel back there too. So that's uh, that's pretty awesome. I really love how they did these dragons and just the way they look. Let's see if we can get some of that shine in there without blinding you from the overhead lights. But yeah, those things look really, really awesome. So, uh, well, I guess might as well. While I'm doing it, I'll take a minute, a couple seconds here. Let me sleeve up these cold foils. Don't want anything happening to them. So, get those sleeved up real quick. And we'll be on to the last two packs of the box. <clears throat> All right, getting down to the nitty gritty here. Last, uh, last couple things. So, let's see. Another Majestic. Didn't see a foil Majestic in the box. Maybe there's one in this last pack, who knows. But uh, I will take uh, I'll take a regular cold foil and a Marvel over uh, over a foil Majestic any day. So, well, and there we go. Foil Phoenix form. So, did hit a foil Majestic in the box. And uh, two, uh, so, foil Majestic, Phoenix form. Okay, it looks, yeah, it looks a little off center, but that's all right. And then, of course, then our two cold foils and best guy here, Vincerakai. Really love the uh, really love the look of those dragons. So, all right. Well, if you haven't yet, uh, feel free. Please, uh, please hit the like button, subscribe if uh, if you're enjoying the content. If you want to see more, get notified. Um, any support you can give there would uh, would be appreciated. So that uh, that'll open end this box opening. So boxes two, three, and four will be coming within the next few days. Be on the lookout. Thanks for watching.